Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. In the last episode, we're here at the Wall, and we were told by the Night Watch that we have to go beyond the Wall and take out all the White Walkers to save the Kingdom of Westeros, and none of that is true. Um, however, we are going to be heading to Lord Gratham's estate. We were given multiple quests by an Imperial Admiral, the Order of Revan, um, a military troop commander over there, and various others that there's a lot going on in Lord Gratham's compound that we're going to need to deal with. So let's go ahead and get to it. Got Mako by my side as always here. And there's the last quest I think we need to get from Captain Bryn. Captain's estate should be just over this bridge. We don't want to get trapped there. Everything I've dug up about Grafton is seriously disturbing, even for a Sith. Oh, I look forward to meeting him then. If we even get to, though. Shh. I have to be very careful. Lord Grafton's eyes are everywhere. He's suspicious of all strangers. He must be blind to our doings. All right. Um, who are you? Who might you be? Captain Bryn, Imperial Special Forces. This work requires intense concentration, a special kind of mind. Grathen's trouble, see? Big trouble. Mad scientist type. Likes weapons, cyborgs, droids, ergonomic chairs. <laughs> My mission's to keep an eye on him. Watch for anything suspicious. But I don't know what you're doing here. You know, a stroll. Just visiting my old friend, Lord Grathen. Can't fool me. Lord Grathen doesn't have friends. Or not many. You got a glint in your eye, like maybe you're not paying a friendly visit. How can you See, how can you tell? I to keep my distance and not enter Lord Grathen's place or cause any kind of ruckus. But I'm supposed to see about a certain prototype turret design the rogue lord supposedly acquired. Empire wants it for mass production. Okay, now what's my part in this? Where do I come in? Lord Grathen's got the turrets hidden inside somewheres. I'd go looking for them myself, but orders are orders. I have to stay put. Since you're going in, you could maybe poke around and see if you can't find the plans to those turrets. Uh, credits, please. I don't work for free. I need money up front. You'll get your pay when you do the job. The thing is, you never get past the turrets unless you take out a guard and get a security badge. The security badge transmits a signal that tells the turrets the badge holder is friendly. So the op is, get a security badge off a guard, find those turrets, and grab the plans. Easy, right? I'll be keeping an eye out here, right where you found me. Oh, quite literally. All right. Well, that's taken care of. Should be easy enough. Now, actually, let me move my drink over here. It's in the way of the radar. There we go. Now, Lord Grathen's estate. We actually have a heroic quest here for the Shadow Spawn. Um, unless someone whispers us about wanting to do it, probably not going to do it this episode. We'll take care of all the heroics that we don't get a group for in one episode before we leave the planet like we did on Hutta. Lord Grathen's estate's over here. That's all the stuff that we need to take care of. And we were actually going the wrong way, weren't we? Let's head this way first, though, just to discover the map. Actually... I think we may have to head here because there is a holocron nearby. Oh, there's someone ta taking on a vine cat prowler. Now, wait to discover this. There we go, the malignant bog. <laughs> it's like the bog of eternal stench. Actually, I think we can actually get to the Holocron from Lord Gratham's estate, so let's go ahead and head over there so we don't have to go through all those elite guys. I don't have stealth technology on this character, so my, uh, my willingness to do that kind of stuff is not what it would be otherwise. Okay, this must be the front door. Hi guys, how are you? My name's Beaudry. I'll be your executioner today. Oh, you're already dead. How convenient. Ah! Caught between the wall. Okay, we got a quest item here. Ah, the Grathen security badge. Good, now all we have to do is explore the weapons lab. Now, for step one of the Grathen assault here, we have to defeat 15 of Grathen's forces, so 
That should be easy enough with what we have. So. I'm not seeing any respawns. So I think we may be here by ourselves right now. There's six. Oh, hello, assassin droid. Just, I like to get these guys in groups. Okay, missiles for you. Oh, man, I am a little bit out of it today. I apologize for that, guys. I just woke up getting my, uh, getting everything in order. Is death from above? Yes. You know, if you're able to time those combos right, Bounty Hunter is so nasty in AoE. Well, there's 12. That seems pretty easy. These guys are... look to be pushovers. Now, the manufacturing plant is down here. I think this is the quest to go find out what happened to that commander's troops. That regiment. So, we'll go ahead and head here first. Killing as we go, obviously. The thing about it is, is I don't remember meeting Lord Grappin in any of the other story modes that I went into. I don't know if he's actually a character that you that you meet. Oh, okay, mission objective is updating. Now we have to defeat 30 of his forces. So it escalates, that's no big deal. All right, here we are in the manufacturing plant. Looks like our objective is up there at the top. Let's... Oh, carbonite for all of you. I like it. Oh, wow, that took out all of those guys. Or it hit all of them, at least. Didn't take them out. Good job, Mako. I like it. I like it when you pull your weight. Now, I guess the ramp is... Okay, up here? It's not saying to go up the elevator. Oh, hi. A manhunter. That's interesting. I guess they have their own kind of man bounty hunters here. Talk to OHK99. Well, there's a trooper. He's dead on the operating table, it looks like. Authorization. Authorization. System cannot identify. Please don't go. Please don't go. What's happening? Are you with Lord Clathen? Are you invading? System cannot identify. Oh, wow. I... I think they, they turned him into cyborgs, if I recall correctly. Where are the soldiers? I'm here for the people Grathen kidnapped. I... I am... I am a soldier. I am a... System cannot stop. Reassigning priorities. Operating number 2188 Please. Did the Duchess send you? Please help me. Okay, well, the Duchess was the one who sent us, and the contract is technically hers, so let's just say I talked to the Duchess. Your commander sent me to free you and the others. We failed him. Failed to defend ourselves. Grathen's people took us prisoner for experiments. The scientists cut open our heads, put us in droids. Identification model OHK-99. They program us for advanced intelligence. Enhanced combat tactics. Now my body's lying dead across the room. I can see it. Oh, wow. These guys are like Cybermen from Doctor Who. Uh, what about the others? Are the rest of the soldiers still alive? I'm the last. The others have all been converted. They can't talk. Can't disobey. 
but I know they can still think, feel. Please, listen. You could disable us all. Send the shutdown command from our central command console. Please, you could put an end to this. Use the command console. I can't go with you, motor and combat systems non-functional. Please, make it stop hurting. Hmm. Okay, well, let's use the command... Okay, there it is. Now we have to go up the elevator. Man, what a bad way to go. And it's not the fact that... Oh, whoops. It's not the fact that they, uh... You know, took the guys... Just their body and their reflexes and everything. It took their entire personality, so they're kind of just trapped in these metal prisons. That was always the part about the Cybermen in Doctor Who that always bugged me more than all of it was the fact that they, you know, that they were they were still people inside. Hello, Grath and Tech Chief. Are you responsible for this? Here. Ooh, stay out of the target site. That's what you deserve. Now, let's check out the command console and see what we can do here. Using this console, you can disable the OHK-99 droids or set them to report back to the Empire. Eee. So disable the droids, send the droids to the Empire. Well, here's the thing. Dutch has sent us to find out what happened to them and to rescue them. Um, obviously they're in bad shape right now. I, I, I'm just kind of thinking about how the contract should be honored. Like, pretty much they're dead. And, hmm. You know what? I'm going to do something uncharacteristically nice, and it does fall within the, uh, the contract. We're disabling the droids. Oh, wow, that got us some serious Mako faction, too. Oh, hi, turrets. How are you guys doing? Had some security issues to deal with, I suppose. Just in time for the elevator, which is good. And I guess we'll head back after we're done with all of our business here at the estate to let Duchess know what happened to her boys. She's probably not going to be happy at all. But the contract was honored. What is that? Grothen Forces lore object. And we still gotta kill all these guys. We've gotta kill 30 of them. Okay. Oh, I already... Whoops. Sorry. That was overkill. What next? I guess we'll head this way. This is to the bounty hunter area. Defeat Grathen Estate Overlords. So we need to kill three of them. And those are, I guess, Grathen's apprentices? That's what I assume, at least. Nice. Good job, Mako. Ooh, I'm still being shot. Now, let's... Well, there's a lot of troops here. I figure we'll just farm outside the complex until we get those 30 for the quest. And then we should be in pretty decent shape all... Ooh, there's a quest on the radar. Who are you? Ismar Brengel. Hello, ma'am. What are you doing out here? Yes, a violent intruder laying waste Lord Grathen's compound. I applaud you. I'm Ismar Brengel, one of Lord Grathen's indentured scientists. I'd like to make your destruction of this place highly profitable. Ooh, I like profit. That's interesting. You've got my attention. Good. We're natural allies, believe it or not. Three years ago, Lord Grathen lured me to work for him. He promised great opportunities and exciting fields of study. Instead, I became a prisoner, slaving on freakish creations Grathen uses to advance himself. It's a thankless existence. Uh-huh. Deal with it, sunglasses. That's the risk you take whenever you work for someone else. The forfeiture of all human rights? That seems a bit much, don't you think? 
Grath and Cybernetics researchers, a sadistic bunch of scum, developed cyborg body parts that regenerate. The technology will revolutionize warfare. It's worth a fortune. I have a buyer looking to manufacture a cyborg army. You'll get 60% of my profits if you steal the cybernetic researcher's files. Oh, that sounds good. I like 60%. You have a deal. For terms that generous, I think we can do business together. Excellent. You won't be disappointed. There is a catch, of course. You'll have to activate the main console by sending override commands from the remote terminals. Grathen protects his computers with lethal security forces. War droids, cyborgs, even genetically engineered weapons. Expect heavy resistance. Not gonna be a problem. I live for that kind of trouble. Must be exhilarating. As long as trouble doesn't kill you. Take this data spike. Insert it into the main console at Grathen's central lab. The spike will download all the data we need. When you're done, bring me the spike. I'll arrange its sale and transfer credits to your account. Go now, be swift. Okay, it's going to revolutionize warfare, eh? Now... Ah, okay, here's all the terminals up here. So let's work our way back. And we can kill all those guys who are guarding that area. And get this quest dealt with. I don't know, 60% is pretty generous. Actually, too generous. All things considered. Oh, I did. <laughs> I was out of range there for the flamethrower. Now there's terminal number one. Oh, B thirteen. Excuse me. Okay, that's one. There looks to be another one up. Oh, we have to go up the gangplank. Okay. It's never easy, is it? Well, how do we get up the gangplank? Is there a stairway or something? Oh, wait a minute. I saw a way up here when we were passing by. Do we have to go up here? Yep. There's the stairwell. What was that? Sound like a healing droid. Oh, okay. Someone was already up here. How convenient. They went ahead and did our job for us. Gotta wait for this to... There we go. Be tappable again. And the third remote terminal. Oh, wow. We got four quests in that compound, don't we? Black Science. So I guess we'll head this that way. We don't need no, your stinking stairs. Well, Mako does apparently, but I don't. We have 15 of Grathen's forces destroyed because of the, the weapons lab. Let's go ahead and finish that out while we're out here. Eighteen. And fortunately, they come in groups of... Oh, we forgot to tap that, uh... Well, first off, let's get some dash. There was that little lore object we could tap for XP. Let's go ahead and take care of that now. Are you by your lonesome? Oh, no, you are not by your lonesome. Hi. You guys have cloaking technology. Oh, why didn't it hit them? Oh, I didn't have it targeted. Yeah, I am. I am still asleep. Hell's bells. Grothin forces. Good. I love me some lore. I always found when playing games that storyline trumped uh, game gameplay. You know, I don't really care. Oh, clashing with Lord Grothin. Achievement completed. Sweet. I always cared more about the story than actual gameplay. The gameplay could be kind of meh, as long as the story was really good. Now, don't get me wrong, there's also, there's always um, exceptions to that rule. But more often than not. Because I came from the generation that played Atari and NES and stuff like that, so we had to use our imaginations more. 27... 
Well, there's, I think there's three right here. Oh, there was two. Now there's three. Actually, there's four. Well, I'm cooking droids right now, Mako. Can you be a little bit more patient? There we go. Oh, we're getting another mission objective. Activate the experimental war bot and take its data core. That Oh, that's right in front of us. Oh, field test control. Okay. Experimental war bot, eh? What could possibly go wrong? Oh, it's a droid deca. Huh. Straight to you from the Trade Federation. Or whatever is existing at this time. Like the Trade Federation. And elite. Ah, you hurt. Some healing would not go amiss right now, Mako. No pressure or anything. Do I have Mako on passive? I guess I do. There you go, now you're actually healing. Dropping the ball. There we go. Experimental Warbot Data Core. Nice. Oh, we completed... Okay, final... Now it's up updating. Turn in the Data Core at the Mission Dropbox. Okay, that was the... That's at the wall. So we got that dealt with. Now we can go into the Weapons Lab. Okay. First, let's recharge and reload. And Mako still wants to talk to us in private. Next time we're in uh, Koss City, we'll break out. We'll head to the cantina so we can chat with her. And, okay. The door's up here. Aid Sith Swat. That's a name to inspire fear. Lord Grathen's Warehouse. And, looks like we have to go up this ramp. Looks like someone may have been here before us, so... People may... We may have all the respawns and whatnot dead. No, oh, doesn't look like it. Grathen Commando. Whoops. Wrong, wrong button. Needs more missiles. We don't have any secondary quests to kill these guys, so that's good at least. So, let's just walk up and flamethrower these guys. Oh, hi. And you guys should be pretty easy to take out now. So much heat. Can't use abilities. Don't need abilities. And who are you? Grathen Inquisitor. Well, let's just go ahead and avoid you. While you're Inquisitoring, we'll send the override signal. Activate the main computer console. Is that back down here? Yeah, it's back down here on the ramp. And... Hmm. Interesting. Let's avoid these mobs if we can. do All right, who? Who's doing it? Oh, you guys are. Like, who's being that guy? I think Mako pulled them. All right, it's just you now. Oh, it's a Grathen apprentice. Haven't even earned his sa her saber yet, or his saber. So it looks like there's a side entrance here. You know what? Let's go ahead and put Mako on right behind you. On passive. We're just gonna run through these guys. Yeah, we're back over here. Actually, we may die doing this, but it's okay. Oh, all the respawns are back up. All right, where do we have to go? Okay, we have to go this way. 
That's okay, Mako. Take those blaster shots like a champ. We got... Okay. Some of them are non-aggroing us. That's good. There we go. That wasn't so bad, was it, Mako? Now we gotta fight our way through here. Come on, let's finish him off. Hadouken! Now, Black Science is here. This is the weapons research facility. Hi, guys. How you doing? I really wish it would keep on. Like, I wouldn't have to re-click it. But that's okay. I think we'll finish this one, and that'll lead all the quests just there in Lord Grathen's estate, I think, and we can start that in the next episode. And I'm not tapping any of the dash piles like I should, I'm just completely spacing it. Looks like the terminal's right there in that room. So let's use a power shot on the droid here. Oh, there's the other droid. What are you doing up there? That makes no sense. Give you a good power shot to the back. Like so. And... Oh, that's disconcerting. Something's gonna bust out of there and attack me, aren't they? Stop! You must not steal that precious data, I implore you. When I'm not locked in Grathen's science dormitory, I'd face you in person. I can only hope the passion of my plea convinces you. I'm Lana Tudrog, lead researcher of Lord Grathen's cybernetics division. That data you're stealing is my life's work. Uh, aren't you a slave? You're another of Grathen's prisoners, right? How is this your life's work? I'm no prisoner. I volunteered for this project because Grathen alone had the resources to help me achieve my goal. I'm the creator of Project ARC, Automatic Regenerating Cybernetics. I've developed mechanical body parts that grow and heal like actual flesh and bone. Making better soldiers is an obvious application, but my dream is to give these lifelike replacement limbs to the victims of war. And that's awesome, but the thing about it is is even if he just like, hey, we have these lifelike replacement limbs to give to victims of war, the technology is still going to go to someone who's going to use them for warfare. The same things are going to happen either way. So that doesn't particularly sway me. You've confused me with someone who cares. Indeed. Don't you see? This technology should be used to heal, not create more killing machines. Lord Gratham encrypted my research notes to prevent duplication. But that data spike will download everything and erase the original. You're taking the only copy. Please don't steal that data. Allow me to continue healing the sick. Yeah, sorry, pal. You weren't part of the contract. I was promised a lot of credits for this, and I plan to collect. I hope you can live with the knowledge you failed to make the galaxy a better place. Enjoy your filthy credits, thief. I will. Let's always make my galaxy a better place. There you go, Bodri. Round of scoundrels and profiteers. I pity you, really. Good day. At least he was polite enough to say good day. Now I think we'll go ahead and turn this back into Ismar. I think her name was, and we'll call it an episode. Which I believe she was this... Yeah, she's over here near... Gra she's right outside of Gratham's main compound. And now it's become a little bit more busy with player characters. We got a uh, Sith Sorcerer here. And looks to be an operative taking cover. So many different play styles. And that's really awesome that all of the classes play so completely differently than the others. Now, the Republic has their counterparts. For the Bounty Hunter, they have the Soldier. For the Operative, they have the Smuggler, or Scoundrel, I, I forget which. 
And then they have the Consular for the Sorcerer and the Sentinel for the Sith Juggernaut. So, different flavors. You I have returned. The sounds of battle echoing through the compound was like music. Made me want to dance. Well, don't leave me in suspense. Did you download the cybernetics data? Are we going to be rich? Yeah, I got the data. Yeah, it's right here. Finally! Oh, I've waited so long for this moment. Everything is in place. I'll send the data spike to my contacts so they can extract and verify the data. It'll be raining credits before you know it. I'm so grateful you crossed my path. You've made my dreams come true. Well, for now, anyway. Enjoy your dreams while they last. Oh, I intend to. You will be paid as soon as my contacts authenticate the data. It shouldn't take long. Okay, we've got tempered laminoid vambraces. Those are not as good as what I'm wearing. I'll take a planetary accommodation instead. Ooh, and we got up to level 15. And we'll go ahead and take care of the talent tree and everything in the next episode, guys. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you liked the video, go ahead and click like down below. Subscribe to the channel or leave a comment. That'd be a big help. And we'll see you next time. Later days, everyone.